So I saw this girl on my show once on the right side in the fifth row on the edge of the bench with a cup of coffee in her hand. The amount of details I remember this with makes me feel bad for all my friends whose birthdays I keep forgetting. Sorry. Anyway, <laughs> she had this curly hair from where your fingers could slide and fall onto her collarbone. You couldn't offer her the moon because she carried the stars in her eyes and I I still remember going breathless mid poem because my heart took a break to admire her. Wow. I sound like a high school boy describing his crush wishing he'd ask her out. But if I did ask her I would have asked her a series of unimportant questions. Like while reading a novel as you trace the running lines with your eyes do you whisper the words? If yes do the sentences shudder at the sound of your joined together to reach your lips and have you walked into a deserted house as a part of a dare because there is a slight possibility that you may have breathed life in it even if it was just for a second and i know this because i am a deserted house actually i am under renovation don't worry this is not a horror story I would have also told her things about myself because I am interesting. Hey, I said sorry for the birthday. I would have told her that I am a book that I myself have a hard time reading sometimes because one, my handwriting sucks, and two, there are chapters in it I wish were written better, both metaphorically and handwriting wise. Although I'm not all pain and tears, I happen to be a little too filmy to the point where I feel like I'm living one. Of course, it's not bad, man, but it's great nonetheless. Or I guess. Anyway, the point I'm trying to make is that I know I wouldn't have been able to go up to her because my low self-confidence would have blurted out something that I would have regretted later, just like Chandler, but less funny, less sarcastic. So people think, why did he say that at all? You get the point, right? So here's me with my dating bio just hoping that someday you'll come across it and swipe right. Do you believe in love over coffee? Because I hate coffee otherwise. <laughs>